All right, all right, all right. Can y'all hear me out there in Radio Land? Welcome to the Lions. I don't feel like they can Welcome hear me. Welcome to the Lions theme. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, boy, I can't hear him in my speaker. Turn me up, DJ. Salon, salon. All right. Hey, who's monitoring us on Facebook? All right, they can hear us. They can hear us. All right, All right. they said they can hear us. All right, yes, I can hear you. Okay, cool. Well, if y'all can hear that's fine. We just got to make do. <laughs> so, uh, welcome to the Lions Den Radio Show. If you've never been on the Lions Den Radio Show, we're going to deal with the issues that are affecting our people. All right. <laughs> uh, I'm one of your co-hosts. I'm Captain OC. Who we got? Officer Kimmy Will. And uh, Kuta so- Kente. <laughs> Soldier Azariah. <laughs> Soldier Azariah in the building. Hey, the bright lights are zoning right now. Yeah, <laughs> man. Don't be nervous. So uh, before we get into it, as always, Officer Kimiel, how was your week in Babylon, man? Uh, it was another week in Babylon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, the president-elect, He life is better, right? Sun's a little brighter. It's White I'm people a little sure nicer. Who is the president? Ah, hey, does anybody know? Hey, I wasn't. I wasn't really. Uh, what was the recount with Bush? When that happened? Uh, Two thousand what? Gore Gore Bush. I was 04? 2000? 2000. 2000 election. I wasn't too much into politics then, but look like it's gonna be another one of them. Yeah, Trump. Trump still. Uh, he's saying he ain't leaving. Yeah. It don't matter. Yeah. He got a few more days to write in the uh, law so he can stay in there forever. Right, 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 right. So uh, we're gonna get into it, y'all. We're gonna get into it. Um, once again. Uh, throughout the show, if you want to call in, you can call in at 863-877-0693. Feel free to call in. You want to share your week, how your week went before we get into it? We'd love to hear from you. Um, Soldier, how was your week, man? It was pretty good. Uh, oh, he I, had I, a good I, week in captivity. You <laughs> voted for you voted for Biden. <laughs> uh, nah, but, uh, I, just, I got a little break from captivity. Okay, okay. You had an off week. Yeah. Master lighting your load this week. All praise. <laughs> well, hey, we don't want you to get too happy. Let's get into this news. Let's get into it. Let's get into this Let's news. Let's pull up that first article. Hey, we need we need we need the soldier bill to read that article. Oh, okay, okay, here we go. <laughs> Kawan Charles, 15-year-old black teen found dead in Louisiana. So let's look at that picture. I mean, I don't want to leave it on too long. Leave it up too long, but you know this. This is a uh, is very disturbing. Um, once again, we are reminded here, mm-hmm. right after the election, right, it doesn't matter exactly. who we vote in. Exactly, America, Babylon, is still not the place of our rest. There you go. Um, I had made a Facebook post about this. A lot of people was excited about a new president, right? But what we fail to understand is that the president does not change the spirits of these people. Mm. It, it it really does not, and this is evident. Mm-hmm. This is part of one of the, they're saying this is the worst thing, one of the worst since um, Emmett Till. Mm-hmm. But they forget what happened to the brother in, um in uh, I think it was Vodosta. Remember he got rolled up? Right. They rolled him up in the, uh, in the gym mat. And, it, and then when they found him, all his organs is missing. All his organs missing. Kendrick Johnson, I think his name was, or something like that. But this stuff been going on and is going to continue to go on over and over and over again. No matter who the president, the president doesn't change the spirits of these people. Go to uh, Sirach chapter twelve real quick. Let's get uh Sirach chapter twelve and verse ten. Because what Bring I people fail to understand is that no matter who's in power. Esau, the so-called white man, he is the devil. The Bible says that his spirit is not right in him. Get that right after this. Read that. The book of Sirach, chapter 12 and verse 10. Uh Uh-huh. Never trust thine enemy. Do what? Never trust thine enemy. Uh Uh-huh. For like as iron rusteth, so is his wickedness. So the same way iron is going to rust is the same way, the same way your enemy is going to show his true colors. 
What is his true colors? Read that. This is the book of Habakkuk, chapter 2 and verse 4. Mm -hmm. Behold, his soul, which is lifted up, is not upright in is him. Is what? Is not upright in him. So the Bible says that his soul, his spirit, is not right. Mm -hmm. It didn't say if a new political party comes in no. that he can change. It didn't say if um, we vote and we elect this person that his spirit will change. It does not matter. His spirit is not right. Go to Wisdom of Solomon. Last one on that one. Wisdom of Solomon 12 and 10. Let me show you what else God says about the spirit of our enemies. Now, he's talking about Egypt in this instance, but it's going for all these other nations. Read that. The book of Wisdom of Solomon, chapter 12 and verse 10. Uh-huh. But executing thy judgments upon them, by little and little, uh -huh. thou gavest them place of repentance. Read. Not being ignorant. What? Not being ignorant. God ain't ignorant. Read. That they were a naughty generation. That they were a naughty generation. Read. And that their malice. And was, that what? And that their malice. Their malice. That hatred. The KKK. The uh, what they what they call it, the Proud Boys. Right. All of these different organizations. That malice. That hatred. That that uh, malcontent for us. Read. Was bred in them. It was what? Was bred in it's them. It's bred in them. That's just how they are. Read. And that they caught the cotitation uh -huh. would never be changed. It'll never be changed. You can't change these people. That's why uh, later on when you read in Sirach, it says you can't um, charm, uh, charm a snake. snake. Yeah. yeah. Who tried to charm right. a snake? You can't You're do gonna it. You're going to get bit. You're going to get bit. You and, are going to get bit. You know that's bit. heavy, Cap, because... If you breed something in somebody, mm -hmm. even when they try to be right. There you go. Even when they try to be good. There you go. It's just not ever. There you go. And that's like, I don't deal with dogs. I know you deal with dogs a little yeah, bit. But yeah. when you got a, a purebred, right. that's just what they are. You can't change it. You can't change You get two of the same, it's going to be that same dog, that blood is in them. That's, that's what God is telling you about our enemy. So, anything else you want to go on this? Nah, because this, this uh, has been hit. Yeah. You know, a lot in. Right, and, right. Uh, Let's move on. Let's move on. So let's get into the next the next uh bit of news we got going on. Okay. This was heavy. I don't know any of these rappers. If y'all know any of these rappers, call in, please. Uh Mo what his name is? Mo three. Mo three. Oh, oh okay. Yeah, right. 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 Give us some back backstory <laughs> on this. What's going on with these brothers? Please. <laughs> you got the backstory, do you know? I don't know. Ah, oh, this brother. I don't know these rappers. So <laughs> apparently we got uh Tupac and Biggie um Beef in tw 2020, same stuff going on. Brothers, brothers is hating one another and rapping against each other, and it end up on a bad deal. Right, right. I I want to read the yeah, first three paragraphs because there's something in here that uh is disturbing because their beef spills out into the neighborhood, mm. right, mm. and affects everyone else. Go right. ahead, read that. Dallas rapper Mo3 shot while driving on highway reports. Mo3 is a Dallas rapper whose real name is Melvin Noble, who was shot the morning of November 11, 2020, while driving on the highway near the Texas City Urban Islands report. There is conflicting information about the rapper's condition, and Heavy is working to obtain more information from police and emergency responders. Update. In a statement to Heavy, the Dallas Police Department confirmed that an accident took place at 11.55 a.m. on the morning of November 11th. They write, an adult male victim was traveling northbound on I-35 at Clarendon Drive when he was approached by a suspect driving what is believed to be a dark-colored car. The the suspect, described as an adult black male, exited his car armed with a firearm and began approaching the victim's car. The victim exited his vehicle and began running southward on the freeway. The suspect chased the victim and fired multiple rounds, striking him. In doing so, the suspect also struck the innocent bystander. That's the part I wanted right there. Right, right. Go ahead. And the adult male who was sitting in his vehicle. Now, when you go on to read, Mo3 died. Right. Um, they said that the other brother that got shot um, was non-life-threatening uh, injury. Right. But yet, this is that terror. 
mm-hmm. that we live under. You know, the most I said, and we, we get the scripture though, but if we break his commandments, he was going to bring terror up. Right, right. And, bring it and out. A lot of this terror comes from our, still the ignorance and the sin of our own people. Our own people. Meanwhile, we want to we wanna ride and protest Trump, and we don't want Trump to come into office and all this, but Trump ain't the problem. Right. right. <laughs> he ain't the problem. Who protesting this? Where's Black Lives Matter at? Where, where, and, where, and, they at? where are they at in Houston right now? Hey, and I want to take a I want to take another approach to this, um, officer, because what I see is two um, prominent figures in the black community. These are rappers that are well known to to the people that's in that society. Um, it's always athletes, rappers, singers. They are the trendsetters. Mm-hmm. If they go out and they got a certain tank top, they got the G unit fat tank top. Everybody go buy the G unit fat tank top. If they got the white Reeboks, you're going to wear the white Reeboks. If they got the soldieries, you're going to rock the soldieries. If they got the flashy glass, you're going to walk that. So what it's telling me is these are the examples for our community. And this is the example that's being set. Living a lifestyle of shooting, gun, 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 gun play, um, lasciviousness, all this different stuff. Go to Judith chapter 8 and verse 24. What we, what we fail to understand is when we uplift these people that are in the world with setting a bad example. But God set us up to be a righteous example for our people. Read that. The book of Judah, chapter 8 and verse 24. Uh-huh. Now, therefore, O brethren, let us show an example to our brethren. Right, because when you, when you, um, I, I, I saw a little bit of this story. The other rapper that he was beefing with, in, in the post that it said that it was announced that this brother's dead, in the in the post below, the other rapper is saying, "Yeah, uh, he got what he deserved, or something along those lines." What what type of example are you setting? And fi- find a scripture where it says, "Never um, be happy about the death of your enemy." For me, uh, officer. but read finish reading that, Judah. Because their hearts depend upon us. Because what? Because their hearts depend upon us. Uh huh. And the sanctuary and the house and the altar rests upon us. You see that. Our people are depending on our leaders. You black men, Hispanic men, Native American men, you sisters out there, the world is looking at you as the example. What we do is setting the tone for the rest of the world. The Bible says their hearts depend upon us. Every decision you make, every post you share, the way you dress, all of that, Somebody's looking up to you. But these brothers don't think about that when they make the decisions that they're making. You found it yet? That's it. Okay. Um, read um, uh, Deuteronomy 28, 65 and 66. I'll read it. I'll read it. Deuteronomy chapter 28 and verse 65. And among these nations shalt thou find no ease, neither shall the sole of thy foot have rest. But the Lord shall give thee a trembling heart and failing of eyes and sorrow of mind. And thy life shall hang in doubt before thee, and thou shalt fear day and night, and shall have none assurance of thy life. So, this is, think about the, uh, so I can't just tell what you're looking for. Um, think about the, um, the brother that's just minding his business, mm-hmm. sitting in his car. Right. Right? And a bullet comes through. Mm. Right? It says in 66, and thy life shall hang in doubt before thee. Right, right. Right. That's what we're dealing with. Life in the hood. That's and, and think about like how a lot of these rappers say, and, and we got a video, uh Steven uh Steven Smith, no Steven Jackson mm-hmm. is, is gonna go into it a little bit about this is all they say they see, but this is what we portray. There you go. There you go. You know, you're not trying to see nothing better. Yep. Because when the example of something better comes out, you don't want to deal there with it. There you that. go. We dealt with that yesterday. Mm-hmm. We, we, we had a brother that he, he trying to get his life together and all the other brothers were clowning. Right, right. That's just like you trying to act white when you get good grades. Right, right. We, we always clown <laughs> We always clown what's, what we're supposed to be doing. Right, right. We, 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 for some reason, we, well, no, it ain't some reason. Go to Jeremiah 422 real quick. We love niggerdom. Right, right. Our people love, we love this stuff. That's why what they got black Twitter. We love Instagram and Snapchat and all. We love that stuff. That's the world that our people love, and the Bible talks about that. Read that. 
the book of Jeremiah, chapter 4 and verse 22. Uh-huh. For my people. For what? Is, for my people. My people. The Israelites, read. It's foolish. We what? It's foolish. What we say, you acting a clown. You acting a donkey. Right. That's our people. Read. They have not known me. Mm -hmm. They are sodish children. Uh-huh. And they have not known understanding. They are wise to do evil. They are what? They are wise to do we evil. We are a people Fair. that are wise to do evil. We get on Facebook, we get on Twitter, and we talk about who we shot and who we going to kill and who we going to have sex with, all this stuff. The Bible outlines it word for word. Read that again. They are wise to do evil, uh -huh. but to do good, they have no knowledge. You see that? <laughs> you see that? You get good grades, you acting white. You get a girlfriend and you actually faithful to her. Bro, what you doing? We going to the club. Right. Oh, black people are the only people, when you get a girlfriend, brothers are mad at you for not cheating on them. They're like, bro, come to the club with me. What's up, man? You got, it's like, what, what is wrong with our people? Well, you know, there's a there's a saying in the world that misery loves company. Mm, mm, that's heavy. You know. That's heavy. You know, and, and, and we as a people, you know, we in a we in a bad state. We know right. that. We don't have right. to we don't have to prove that. But that's why, yeah. If if, if my situation ain't right. good, I don't want your situation there you go. to be any better. Hey, you know what's happening? Somebody said something to me the other day. They said, um, when somebody say you can't do something, what they're really saying is that they can't do it. Right. Right. That's what <laughs> Jake, that's Jake, Jake do that a lot. Like, say you finna, you like, yeah, I'm gonna I'm I'm save up, I'm gonna get my credit right, I'm gonna get a house. No, you can't do that. What they really saying is they can't do it. What you want a house for? Right, right, you right. You white. <laughs> Are you trying to read? <laughs> what? <laughs>